he's one of the best in the NBA right now. So NBA and MLB. What's up guys? Welcome to a new vlog. I am just about to head out of the house to go meet up with Tara and Katie because we are all getting lunch together. We are all going to Sweet Green over by the Grove. Should be delicious. And then I'm not sure what the plan will be for like the next part of the day, but then tonight, um, me and Khan and Tara and Taylor and Katie and Colin, we are all going to a baseball game and I'm super excited because the Phillies are playing and um, my family is like a Phillies family. Um, I always hate saying that I'm a fan uh, when like I really don't pay attention or know anything about it, but it's my family team, so yeah. We are going to go there. Super excited to see Bryce Harper because I really hope he plays and he's one of the best in the NBA right now. So NBA and MLB. <laughs> oh God, that goes to show how much I know. Okay, let's go. Hey, for Jill? Yeah, no worries. I got the spicy Thai, so did Katie. Tara got guacamole greens. <laughs> As always, it's the best. <laughs> All right, and I'm home again. <laughs> Let's see, what time is it? It's 4.11. I'm currently pretty bummed because we're going to a Phillies Dodgers game later, and I was pretty damn convinced that I had a Phillies t-shirt. And I guess I don't anymore, which is sort of a bummer. I wish that I would have kept it. So I think I put in a load of laundry here um, and I have some clothes that I want to put away. But then I want to start on the process of cleaning out my closet, which is going to be such a bitch. I'm really dreading it. <laughs> but it has to be done. And so I'm just going to start it today. I really have to do my closet, my drawers, and my beauty products. Um, we're going to focus on just the closet today. Take it from there. Okay, this pile is massive. <laughs> I have been trekking away at it, but it feels like it's not getting smaller. Um, and the reason why it's taking so long is because I'm taking photos of everything for Poshmark as I go, and then folding it so that I can put it away where I wanna keep it, um, and keep it fairly nice if I can. Oh my gosh, but this is going to take so long. I probably won't be able to finish this today. I'll have to spend the night at Connor's because my bed <laughs> will be occupied. Not gonna work. Can't believe it, but I made it through the pile and um, I've started loading in. The way I'm gonna store them is up in these top parts of my cabinets that I can't reach. But I'm already running out of space and I have quite a few more things. So um, I haven't quite figured out what I'm gonna do yet here. All right, managed to fit the rest of the stuff up there. And that's gonna have to do, um, actually, these three jackets couldn't fit just because they're sort of bulky, but there's only three of them, so I'm just gonna hang these up in my closet still in the meantime, because they won't take up too much space. Genuinely doing all of that made me break out in a sweat. So, <laughs> anyway, I just got changed now. I have black jeans on now. And we are ready to go to the baseball game. Um, I am going to leave my camera at home. I might take some vlog clips on my phone, but I don't feel like carrying this big thing around with me, so. This is mostly gonna be like a closet cleaning organization type vlog, not like a normal vlog. So aside from whatever I get at the baseball game, I'll see you guys the next time that I'm organizing. I did wanna show you quickly, like look at how many hangers. I had no hangers left and now I have so many. So cleared out a lot of stuff, a lot of stuff from in here as well. So I'm feeling pretty good about the work that I did today. Made it to the game and the Phillies are losing, but that's okay because it makes for good crowd, crowd camaraderie. Yeah. That's what it does. Yeah, so it's fine. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, clap, 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 clap. Oh we love the clapping. We love the clapping. <laughs> Just 
putting some water on the stove because I'm about to make lunch. Um, spent the morning here working on some stuff um, because I just wanted to spend the morning getting a little bit of work done before we commit the rest of the day to organizing and cleaning and all of that. So after lunch, we'll move into that. But I wanted to let you guys know that I'm launching a campaign today that will go from today, which is the third, up until the ninth, um, end of the day on the ninth, um, where any money that I make from my digital store, 50% uh, of it is going to be donated to the Pride Fund. And the Pride Fund is the only LGBT organization that sole purpose is to try to put an end to gun violence. I'll have a link to their website down below if you wanna read more about the issues, but they just want, um, better background checks for people buying guns. They want restricted access to assault weapons as well as um, stopping people who have been convicted of hate crimes from being able to purchase uh, guns. So there's a link to my store down below um, if there's something on there that interests you. Uh, know that this week, 50% of that money will go towards the Pride Fund. So if that's something that you are uh, passionate about as well, now seems like a good time. Or if you're not interested, like I said, I'm gonna have the link to the Pride Fund website d below, and you could just go and donate your money instead of buying something for me. Doesn't matter either way. <laughs> I just want to donate some money. I thought it'd be cool since it's Pride Month to do that. So I just wanted to make sure that I let you guys know about that, and now I'm going to make lunch. I'm just making something like small and quick, and then we are going to get into our organization. I keep getting distracted by work things, um, <laughs> but we are finally getting started on what today was meant to be about, which was the organization. So. Um, I think the plan is to finish up clothing stuff. So I'm going to go through my drawers, reorganize and fold those. So that's good to go. And then we're going to start on beauty products um, and see how it goes. I don't know. Um, but I wanted to show you because I only showed my story. I recently got a delivery from Pop and Bottle, which is a um, vegan coffee brand. They're vegan, fair trade, paleo, gluten-free, non-GMO, and women funded. So that's pretty cool. I had the vanilla latte one yesterday. It was pretty good. So um, I'm going to try the matcha one today. Matcha can be pretty hit and miss. So I don't know how it's going to be. Tastes good. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Cool. I can get behind that. I might even like it better than the vanilla latte one. No, the latte one was very good, but this, this is really amazing too. Now, let's stop procrastinating and let's get started. <laughs> Okay, this was the main drawer that needed cleaning and reorganizing, so um, got rid of this stuff. It's a pretty small pile, but it was only stuff from that one drawer, so um, happy with that. And just finished reorganizing, so we have some long sleeves here, and then these are like colorful crop tops and tube tops. And then inside this bin, we have white t-shirts and dark colored t-shirts, and then um, white crop tops and dark colored crop tops feel good about that. So I'm quickly going to take photos of this stuff that way I just have that out of the way and then we are going to move on to my to my beauty to my beauty drawers um, as well as underneath my sink because I have tons of products down there that never even get touched so it just has to get cleared out. All right, just finished reorganizing the closet here. I sort of moved these bins around because one of them that I ended up having to get into more often than I thought was being blocked over here. So fixed that, cleaned out my shoes and just this sort of corner area there was like trash and stuff. Picked out a bunch of shoes that I'm going to get rid of. Um, some trash which I put in there. Making our progress here. Just ran downstairs and opened two packages because I figured that it would be stuff that would have to factor into my organization anyway because I mostly get products and clothes, so <laughs> there you go. Um, the first one are these shoes that are from M. Jemmy. Um, they make my favorite sandals, which I wear literally like all summer long. They're pretty beat up at this point. I should probably get a new pair, but I'm obsessed with them. They are crazy comfortable. So I wanted to get another pair of shoes from them. These are obviously a little bit nicer of sandals. They have a tiny little heel. 
So love those. And then the other is from Lord Jones. This is their Royal Oil, which looks like it's just a CBD oil that you can use on your body when you're having aches and pains. Great, all right. Back to organization, right Molly? I know, I'm bored too. <laughs> we are going to start off with my Alex and I drawers. I have a ton of shit up here. Um, so I'm gonna start to go through these and this is my box of things that I'm going to, I guess I should have two boxes or a box and a trash can or a trash bag because I'm going to throw out some stuff and I'm going to keep some stuff for giveaways. I'm watching The Sopranos while I work. <laughs> organized crime, organized makeup, it might as well be the same. Why does cleaning things literally just make everything messier? <laughs> but under here is looking a lot better. Do you think I have enough shampoo and conditioner? <laughs> yes. <laughs> um, hair stuff got cleaned out. Just a little bit more organized, which is nice. Oh my goodness, you guys. <laughs> oh, I'm tired. What time is it? 4.30 already. Jeez. Not even really finished yet. We made really good progress today, I think. I think I've gone through everything now. So sort of the last step would be cleaning, um, but we're not gonna do that today. I have a giant box of stuff here that is gonna be used for giveaways. So I'm just going to clean up like the stuff that I need to, throwing away boxes and stuff like that, but we did pretty good, you guys. I feel good about this. All right, took all the trash and recycling out, finished cleaning up a little bit, um, and my camera's dying, so one second. And we're back. Yeah, so I guess I'm gonna turn this into like a two-part video. Um, the actual like cleaning out of all of my stuff in this video, and then in the next video, we can do actually like cleaning because I wanna clean everything, like take stuff off shelves and dust them and all of that because I never do that and, and I need to. <laughs> so yeah, but I feel pretty good about the progress that we made today. I can tell that I did a lot because my back is now killing me. Perfect. <laughs> Making these shrimp because they're essentially the only thing that I have in my fridge. I really need to go grocery shopping. I think I'm gonna do that tomorrow, but um, these are just gonna pop in there. All right, here is my dinner. I had leftover garlic right rice mixed in with broccoli because that's what I had for lunch. I forget if I showed you that. Um, but I used some of those leftovers, put some salsa in and my shrimp on top, and I have enough for two little wraps like this, so it should be delicious. Don't I look pretty? <laughs> I just decided that I wanted to do a mask, which is why I'm putting my hair back like this. I want to use one of these Dr. Dennis Gross masks here. I think I want to use this one. Hydrating modeling mask. And if I recall, um, from when I got a facial done with them, you have to like mix it yourself. Yeah, like see it comes with like all these cups. You just like squeeze this whole packet right into this bowl. And then, you add the activating powder and then you mix it all together with the spatula and then it says to apply it immediately to your face using this spatula and when she did mine she literally put it over top of my lips and everything it made my lips feel really nice so i'm going to do the same thing even though it feels sort of crazy while it's happening Go over top of the lips. Here we go. <laughs> oh man. I'm just gonna go rinse the rest of this off of my face. So we're just gonna finish up our skincare here now. I'm just gonna use all Dr. Dennis Gross stuff just to finish us off. So this is the Do It Right Eye Gel. And apply right underneath my eye. Then we need Overnight Retinol Serum. Some of that. And then we need this Night 
moisturizer, which also has retinol in it. And I like to apply moisturizer very generously. Then we're gonna use their retinol neck treatment. Small little bit of that. Apply this in a nice upward motion. And then their cushion. And our skincare for the night is complete. I'm gonna put some zit cream on this little guy that I got down here. And by little guy, I mean massive melon on my face. Um, and then our night's pretty much over. Nice hair. Things are going really well for me. <laughs> All right, guys, bedtime. Thank you so much for watching this vlog. Hope that you liked it. Hope that it inspired you to get some spring cleaning or spring cleaning out done of your own since I didn't do much cleaning. It's a lot of cleaning out. And I'll see you in my next vlog. Bye.